Good evening, I'm Candace Barnett. Wade Phillips is off tonight. We begin with a local church pastor who was fired last night. Mount Sterling Baptist Church in Butler let Pastor Jonathan Greer go. Greer is now talking to News Center 11 tonight about the situation and how he says race played a role in his termination. Tom Williams has more in tonight's top story. Mount Sterling Baptist Church in Butler, without a pastor as of Sunday evening. Pastor Jonathan Greer's termination was put to a vote. 31 people unanimously voting him out of the church. This comes after he says a deacon told him he could not invite black people to their vacation Bible school. There was pushback about where the types of children that we were bringing in, and I was asked to not invite um, black children to the VBS. I spoke with Freddie Moore, who was a deacon at Mount Sterling Baptist Church. He did not want to go on camera for an interview, but he says it's not a race issue whatsoever. He says Greer wouldn't work with the deacons. He claims the termination was because he would not visit members of the congregation. Moore says Greer only visited a few. This was a particular deacon that, that did ask me, and ultimately two deacons that had asked me not to invite black people. Moore says anyone, regardless of race, is welcome to their church at any time. Pastor Greer says that's what he was led to believe when he first joined the church. Um, what they really mean is that someone can wander in off the street and they won't stop them, but they specifically asked me, explicitly asked me to not invite black people. Um, and I, I tried to communicate with them that that's just not consistent with Christianity. Greer says the deacons wanted him to resign from the church quietly. Due to the church bylaws, Greer chose not to. He says his sermon on Sunday was on racism. I wanted the church to, to know that this is not consistent with the gospel. This is not consistent with God's word that we honor and give dignity to all people. Um, that's what the Bible teaches us, and all people are worthy and in need of the gospel. And racism denies that to a certain amount of people. In Butler, Tom Williams, News Center 11. Jonathan Greer wants to make clear that he did not contact WTOK for an interview and he felt it was best to talk about the situation since News Center 11 started inquiring. Now, he has been pastor of Mount Sterling Baptist Church for a year and a half.